Y'all, I've done um, another video before this one um, where I was cooking, but it stopped and so I didn't finish it. But uh, I wanted to share some inner thoughts with you guys um, in efforts to try to hold myself accountable. A lot of times when you have a problem with someone or when you have a, an extreme pet peeve, it's because it's something that you may feel insecure about yourself. And I've tried to use that as a way of learning more about myself and trying to um, be more positive and um, basically turn the mirror on myself when I'm trying to show people something that I may have felt was wrong um, and make sure that that's not something that I'm doing also. So one of my major pet peeves that have been rearing its ugly head lately is um, just attitudes. And I wanted to make sure that maybe my attitude um, couldn't be improved. And I've said before to myself, I've said to to others and recognized in myself that um, I can be very flat in my affect a lot of times especially when I'm feeling a range of emotions inside and I tend to be very monotone and um, if I do get riled up it's because I have passed a point of self-reflection and move more into a, a defense so I've been trying to work on that with me and um, although I don't have what I would traditionally characterize as having an attitude problem um, in that if I'm angry about something or I'm upset with someone um, I don't give them I guess what I would call active attitude I'm not like mm -hmm, whatever yeah just get out of my face I'm not like that I'm more of okay yes I'll do that for you and and that's it um, so with that said that's still an attitude so um, my thing is though what do I replace that with? Um, forced enthusiasm? Faked enthusiasm? Um, how do I not just be like, Ugh, when I'm dealing with people who have pissed me off? Um, a, a complication to that problem is that I don't like conflict, so I tend to... Um, when I am upset with people who are close to me that I don't, that I have to deal with on a day-to-day -day basis, I don't address issues that I don't feel like are major. Major, i.e. costing me money, hurting me or my family, or um, disrespecting me in some way. But there are things that I should still speak up about if there are issues and I should speak up about them at the time. I should work on a way to do it um, and try not to be so confrontational about it. I have to understand that even if I come in a way that's not flat and affect or um, fake enthused, um, if, even if I come correct, that doesn't mean that the person that I am interacting with will. And I have to be able to handle that. And um, it's very easy to teach, but very difficult to practice. So, I need to do better in addressing issues that may cause me later to have a flat affect or an attitude. I should address them so that I can derail the situation and get back to my normal 
um, disposition. And um, I don't know. I, should I tie something to my finger to remind me? Um, I don't know what I can do to remember in those times to step back. Any suggestions? Um, I have to be an example for those that are around me. So when I can figure out how this is supposed to be done, when I can figure out how to address issues up front um, to avoid having an attitude as opposed to avoiding saying anything to avoid any conflict um, because it, I, I, I avoid conflict but I cause tension. So when I learn to stop doing that, um, the people around me will pick up on that and they will learn it too. So it's very important because that is a major pet peeve and a source of discomfort for me lately. Um, so any suggestions, let me know.